Hello, I'm Luis from Mexico, and today we're going to talk about air painting with OpenCV. Our project consists in creating an air canvas using OpenCV or webcam and using these markers. The first part is selecting the color, and the second part is putting those values of the color and then modify the object or the mask to obtain the point to draw the image. Color picker. On our program, we're going to capture the frames from the image and then that image, we're going to change it into an HSB image, which means hue saturation value. And this kind of image, this kind of like transition help us to detect the color in an object easily. As you can see on the screen, we we're going to print the values from the hue, the saturation and the value. And uh, this is the values of the color we want to apply on the mask. So this is how we work. This is the track part. Then we have the mask and then we have the values from the mask. As you can see, we have the HSB image there with the normal image. So this is how we detect the color of the object. In this case, it's a pink color. And also we detect a blue color. The other part is applying the mask. So we store those values. We write it first in a notepad. And after that, we're going to uh, copy and put them on the vector, this nested vector. We're gonna then we're gonna create a then we're gonna create this mask and we're gonna put the values that we had. So we're gonna have two masks from the blue color and a second mask from the green color. Then we're gonna put these values on an uh, on two frames. One is going to detect the mask of the color blue and one is going to detect the mask of the color pink. So we're going to put them on fine color. Uh -huh. This is so far the project that we have developed. And as you can see, I'm holding the blue color and it's detecting it on the first mask. And we have the pink color and it's detecting the mask on the second image frame. So here we are in Visual Studio and we're going to test the program. The first, as I said, we have the project, uh, the main project code, and as well, we have the color picker code. So we're going to exclude project, the main project for a while. And then we're going to include the color picker in the project. And after that, we're just going to test it. I just want to show you how we can detect the values. So for that, I need to need disable my camera. So say like that, and it's gonna work. And yeah, as you can see, we have the frames and we're gonna uh, play with the values. So we can just get the, the value of this marker. We can check the saturation, not too much. So this is basically how we check it uh -huh. i'm not gonna do it here because it's kind of hard and it takes a long time so yeah we're just gonna take it out and as you can see here are the values that i'm playing with and the next part we're just gonna exclude it from the project again we're gonna include them in project and we're gonna run it so as you can see in the camera, we're going to have to mask. We are going to detect the color blue. Uh -huh. It's already detecting. Uh -huh. And we're going to detect the color pink. Uh -huh. So here is the repository on GitHub. You can check it. And I hope you have liked the exposition. Thank you.